everyone. Uh, today I am discussing about the indicator, factor indicator. So many of you know are using in a wrong way. I just give an idea. So whenever you will take a trade, uh, we must test and form with some kind of indicator, right? So for that purpose, I am using an indicator. I will show you how the way you can use this kind of indicator. So I am taking the factor indicator. So you know that there, there is a uh, trend, okay? Like you can take this an uptrend, the market is coming like this. So you can use only for the call option, okay? When the factor appear in the opposite direction, you can take a call. Also, if it is a downtrend, then you can take a put option, okay? So here, I just uh, tell you about in the uptrend. So you consider this is an uptrend market, okay? The candle is coming like this. So we may we have to make a call option for this, right? So what is the key for this is you should uh, uh, wait for the candle to pull down, okay? So I just draw the, the candles here. So I get uh, three kind of candles. Uh, this candle may have a big sometimes, right? And sometimes you will not find any kind of big. So the thing is, if there is a, a three candle in the uptrend, okay, you find out there is a signal, okay, you find out there is a signal of uh, factor indicator, which is shown in the direction of up, okay, it is shown in the direction of up, so you can take a call from, from this, okay, so how we can take a call is, so you, you have to know it is an uptrend, so uptrend you will take only the call direction, don't go in the opposite direction. So the thing is, you find the three sequence of candle and you find the low of that candle. If the low of that candle is higher than the previous two candle, if you get the indication, then you can take a call trade here. Okay, you can take a call trade. So this is what the thing. So same as for the uptrend, uh, uh, you have... Uh, you can follow for the downtrend. So downtrend, how we can take uh, the candles in the formation of uh, down, you, uh, you think about this, you kind of, uh, some candles you are getting, uh, like sequence of candles, which is uh, red candles are coming. Okay, now in the downtrend, we will uh, go for a, take a put option, right? So you will wait for the green sequence of candle after this formation. So the green sequence of candle appears in the market. You, you wait for the three candle. Okay, you just wait for the three candle. This high of this candle, okay, the high of this candle must be lower than the previous two. So now you get the signal over here. In this position, if you get the signal, like the signal is, in uh, like this red signal if you are getting then the factor indicator is appeared then immediately you can place a put option for this okay you have to wait for a put option so this i am telling for in the downtrend okay so downtrend the market makes the high and we get the factor indicator then we can take and this is for an up we take a, a call indication for this up moment okay let me show you in the marker how we can use. So I will um, share you this. In this, uh, you can see uh, the screen. In this, in this, I just apply the indicator. So when you click on the popular, you will get the indicator as factor over here. So the default factor you can use. How so many of them use uh, three, seven? You can use five, five is more better. So this green will show in the downwards. And uh, you can see when I apply, uh, the green will show in the top and the bottom. Okay, can you see this is in the downtrend now? Okay, so as I said, when you find there is a downtrend market, you find the candle, this previous high is greater than the high and you're getting the big. Okay, if it is, uh, sometimes you get for the red, because higher, then you can take. Okay, so I will I will draw for the same condition for uh, red also. The same thing, uh, you can see the the candle uh, which makes uh, in 
in the up direction. Okay, so we are talking about uh, down. So I will draw for the down. So you see there is a up uh, up candle. Okay, green candles so are moving, and you will get a lot of uh, candles over here uh, in this. In this, I just take a wick of this. So you, you, uh, you find that uh, the green candle, the green candle wick is there, but still the fractal is not appear in this direction. Okay, you just wait for the next candle of the red. Okay, the red moment of the candle, which appear like this. Okay, if the red have the wick as higher, then you can make a put option again. Okay, so you must wait for the factor indicator whether the factor is giving us uh, the clue here in this direction. Okay, so uh, the factor will show like this in this direction. If, if it is appearing, then you will go for the put trade in this. You can immediately go for a put option. Okay, so same for the so this is for the Trade. Okay, so now you can see the screen here. This factor, as I said, downtrend. When you have a wick, the red candle, we have a greatest uh, wick, and the factor is indicating you can go for a put option immediately for the next. You can see here this is called. Right, uh, here the three candles there, the fact will not appear for this high, it is up here, so you can take a put option here. Okay, so similar as this one, we can we can find the opportunity in um, this, so we will take a trade here. So, I will show you for the uptrend also. I will take the other pair. So, here you can see here this is a uh, sequence of candle which shows a high, you can take a put option here too. So this you can find higher big factor indicator it works. Higher big factor indicator it works, right? So for same for the uh, uptrend, I'll show you. You can see here, this shows that small of the three candle with the big, so it has gone. Okay, so uh, here also you have a two candle, but the big is greater, it moves up. Okay, so maximum you choose the market for the three sequence of candle that will that will be um, makes you uh, better. So here you can see three candle. The larger we graph here factor indicator, so it shows a call option, and we can find the other. We can see this is an uptrend, right? So you can see the three candles, the big uh, which is greater the low. Then it goes up over right here too. So the factor will show you the correct indication of the market. So in this, you can see here, here too, three candles, lower wick. If it is uh, sometimes in after the three, the green wick is greater, you will get a factor indicator like this. You get a factor indicator for this. Then you take a call option. Then uh, here you can see so the, there are so many opportunities you will get for the using the factor indicator. We will see the current market. You can see the currently the large big the factor up here. It is going to be down. We will find the other opportunity. There is an uptrend. Right? We have a signal here and it has been called up. Right? So we are looking for the new level. Once we have find out the pairs, we will take a trade. In this also, it makes up. Okay, we will see in the next. We get an opportunity here. So this is a downtrend. Wait for the confirmation signal of the factor indicator. Once we get, we will take a put trade here. So this red is a bigger one when you compare to this green. So once factor up here, I will take a put trade. So you can see.
Factor, you must trade if it, if it is up, you should pay uh, for up, okay? If it is down, so here I have written for the down signal, okay? Because it is manually down, so I taken this trade for the downwards. So let's see, uh, we take the confirmation here, we have the factor appears, we taken this trade. So let's uh, see, run down the last 15 seconds of there. Moving down, yes, it is coming. It, it came down, right? So, this one works. You know the, how to work it is, uh, and you work. So this is a red signal we get in the red candle. Let's see the green candle. If we get the signal, we will take the green candle. So, we are going slowly this down. It is mostly an up. So in this, uh, this is one, we wait until it gets lower. Then we can find the other opportunity in other pair. In this, yeah, we have a bench, our confirmation that this cost. Here we have the perfect confirmation and lower three candles with the lower. Now we, I get the confirmation here. I will take a yeah, I get a confirmation. It's too late. The signal should be taken up. So this is a minorly uptrend. I get a factor indicator signal in this. And the three candle sequence and factor indicator and it is a low. So it will go up. So we will wait until this to cross. Can you see? So through this, we can make more winning in this factor. If you work, we, uh, if you know how to work, then this will trade. So you should place this trade. Only on the uptrend, up direction, factor up here, and the condition satisfied, then you have to take a trade. Can you see? It's a winning trade. So, this is how uh, the factor is working. So, you also work in this. It will surely work. And see, now it is downtrend. It is only the upward direction. So, it is not a correct way to trade. If it is a downtrend, you should go for the down. And if it is uptrend, you should go for an up. So it is a downtrend. When you get a signal here, you should go for a downwards. Okay, if it is an uptrend, you should get a signal over here. You will go for an up direction. So that gives you maximum ratio. So uh, if you take a 10 trade, uh, if you, uh, more, more over 9 or 8, you will get a win. So that I can guarantee you uh, by using this pattern. But you should follow the rule. What I said earlier. So if you follow the rules, you can win this fatal trade, right? So hope it is useful. See you in the next.